Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace, and it's Monday, Meet Monday. Oh, hello everyone again. Hey, I know, I will do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. <laughs> he's, he's saying that I have to go back, which I will go back, and he's like, where are you from? I'm from here. <laughs> but where is here? Where is here? It's right here. Where is here? Where? right here okay hi everyone I'm from I'm known a, oh gosh take three hi everyone I'm from no wait a minute take four <laughs> <laughs> hello everybody I'm Nona Grace yeah that's who I am okay and I am from Western New York I know where I'm from and I know who I am only it took me a little while to get there. <laughs> okay, today I wanted to, because I forgot to do it with all the excitement of Sunday. And I don't know whether it was Sunday or Saturday I was supposed to do it, but Sunday was really a day that my mind was all on other things and I forgot. But I had a little request from the cutest, from Fox, the cutest dog in the West. They thought that I had made a t made a pillow out of the t-shirt. I hadn't made a pillow. I had told them that I, I put it in a picture frame. And this is the picture frame that I put it in. That when I had won the t-shirt, this is a t-shirt in here, painted. In there, and it's it's so pretty. And I get so many compliments about my picture, that I have. You can do it. I don't know which way I should do it. To be honest, I flip it whichever way I like it. For the day there it's got the glare gone <laughs> this is a glary glass i'm sorry it's not the non-glare but anyways yeah i, I have the t-shirt in here this i won from from fox oh quite a while ago and i i don't wear t-shirts as you notice i'm sure you've noticed i don't wear t-shirts but it was cute it was really cute and i thought It'd be a shame to ruin the picture, so I decided I'd put it in a picture frame. Okay, now there was, um, I'm going to show you some snowbells outside. Spring has sprung in our area. And I'm going to show you the hens. They're going to see some of the hens. And what else did I show? I showed the wood chip pile. What else did I do when I went outside? Oh. Hi ladies. Hello little girl. How you doing? Oh, what you doing? You coming to see what I have, Emma? Hi Emma. You're always coming to see. This is Emma, everyone. Hello. Can tell by her fluffy butt. They all have fluffy butts, but hers is different. And hello to you. Oh, you were gonna dash or duck. What was it you were gonna do? I need to go out that door so you can travel a little further. Oops, I better go the other way. I don't know if you'll follow me out or not. This is the pile of wood chips that we had left over. Not too bad. I want to show you some flowers. We actually have some spring springing up on us. What you looking at? Right for you. Oh. Waiting for you. Waiting for me. Well, I'll get my shadow out of the way. I don't want my shadow in it. Look, spring has sprung. I have a few flowers. They're the little snowbells, I think they're called. I don't know. There used to be a lot of these in the front yard. I haven't seen any in the front yard. Still there, I don't know. They come up yet. I don't know. This is where my daffodils are supposed to be coming up, but I don't see any. Right where you're standing. I know. There's nothing there. No well, daffodils. It's still a early for the daffodils. After all, it is only the early part of March. So. And we have lots of moss. <laughs> it grows. The kids like to dig this up. They 
dig it up out of the sidewalk, out of the stone, paving stone. I don't know. I was so with you. I think that was it. I took the dog out for a walk, but I didn't show that. He wanted to go outside. It was really nice outside today. I went to the bank today to um, correct Emily's account, and oh, good Lord. It takes until Tuesday for everything to be good, but it'll be good in time for her to go to get her car inspected and the oil changed. But it's it's like, really? Tuesday? Tuesday is a day that Jim gets his windshield fixed. He has to call that, those, um, hotel, hotel to yeah, see if we can get our money back. On the two rooms that we don't want, hmm, this ought to be interesting. And it's also supposed to be Music Monday, and I've debated if I wanted to play anything or not. I did get the instruments out, but I wanted to show you. That's what? the other thing, your your meal for today. Oh, yeah, I showed my meal, my meal for today. I showed you my two meals. I did um, my my first meal and my second meal. Today is Meat Monday, so I'm going to have four pieces of turkey. And I, in the turkey, I've got some mayonnaise, and then I've rolled up two um, cheese sticks. I've kind of st separated them and put it between the four pieces. And that will be my, my first meal of the day at 2.15. This is meal two for Meat Monday. And because it's supposed to be products of um, dairy or animal products is supposed to be. It doesn't need to be dairy. It can be meat. It's meat and dairy are animal product. But I have condiments with mine too. So I'm going to have some hot sauce and some salt. And the other thing I'm putting on, oh, there's my TV control. Um, the other thing I'm putting on is sour cream. I want to mix it together and shred the chicken and eat it that way. That's how I'm going to have it. For, I, for what day? For Meat Monday. I said Meat okay. Monday earlier in the beginning when I was messing up my name. <laughs> I believe it was in there. But the um, some of you like the ukulele. This is the ukulele. This is the soprano ukulele. Concert soprano. I do have a soprano one that's tinier. I like this size. And they say that to tell whether a ukulele is suited, you're supposed to play the strings up here, past the little open of the hole. It's supposed to be more up here. And I just tuned it so it should be good. I tuned it on the computer and I tuned it with my, with my tuning thing. What you looking for? Oh, the song. I don't know if I'll do it or not. If you do it. I, I had Timey Kangaroo Down Sport is what I had. I've been I was playing. And it's and what I wanted to say is like when you do C on a ukulele, it's just one little note. And when you do F on a ukulele, it's just two little notes. G7, you just leave your pointer where it is and you move, and it's three little strings. Actually easier to finger to um, do the chord. The guitar for me is harder. Why? First of all, the neck is so fat. I have a fat neck. <laughs> My neck's not too fat, but the neck on the guitar is too fat. I think they make these thinner now. I don't know. This was this is an old guitar, so maybe they made them fatter. But to do an F on a guitar, I would have to go ding, 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 and it's like, it's pretty, but somebody must be posting. No. It's saying oh, it's saying I'm, a, I'm in key. In key. <laughs> <laughs> 
it's an F. And then I did a G7. I don't remember G7. I think it's maybe there. I don't remember. Mm -hmm. But I don't play those notes. I usually play the G. And as you can see, it's a lot of fingers that are kind of stretched. And I play D. you get the gist of it. But that's how you would do it on there. And then with the other, with the ukulele, it was actually easier. But I'm not very good because, you know, when you switch back and forth, it amazes me. People that switch back and forth from instruments, how in the world do you remember the fingerings? Different tone.